we played football just the next to it, so we used the, the plastic bags from, from the garbage to make football. Dandora is a pretty difficult place. Unfortunately, you have poverty, you know, so the only thing was football or crime. I got lucky because I stuck to football. Most African players, they don't want to talk about it. Some don't want even to go back because they say it's, uh, it's terrible, it's horrible. But for me, I'm proud of where I come from. And uh, it's from, for that, I, I really want to give back. I want to give something back because it's a struggle. It was a struggle for me and it's still a struggle for a lot of kids. When I see all this here, I, the first thing that comes in my mind is, why can't I have this in, you know, in Kenya, in Dandora? English Premier League, La Liga, Serie A, Zote. Bora tu ni kujeni sedie, watu wa getu, ni watu wa pali. The academy made my mentality to see football as a career when I was a kid. Okay, I earn around a thousand dollar, approximately a thousand dollar, and it does help a lot now because I can even pay my sister's school fees, in the university, pay my my mom rent. I can even buy. A kid a boot because when I was in the academy, some people bought me boots. So now I can do the same. I want to be irrelevant. I don't want to be having a foundation to help. I want to grow up in a world that all these things are being are being catered for. But now it's yeah, it, break my, it breaks my heart that I am needed because it's that means that yeah we are, we still have a long way to go.